This episode of Unbox Therapy is brought to you by Gamefly. What's up guys, Lou here, and today we're taking a look at this. Yes, a traditional mechanical hard drive. We're not talking too much about these anymore in the world of technology. It's all about SSDs, as you guys know. Uh, this is a Western Digital three terabyte green drive, and these mechanical drives still represent sort of the best way to get a bunch of storage at an affordable price, as you guys know. I've got two of them here. I'll be using them in a RAID, a RAID 1 to be specific, and this one's still wrapped up, but they are identical drives and they're Western Digital Green. Now the reason I chose green drives is because I like some of the attributes that they have. For example, they're quiet, they have a variable uh, spinning speed, RPM, if you wanna call it that, anywhere from 5,400 RPM to uh, 7,200 RPM, meaning that they sort of are an on-demand system giving you the type of performance you need when you need it, and they can pretty much shut down when you don't need it. So you're gonna get quiet and cool operation which for me is sort of the most important aspect of a storage drive since that's just what it is, a storage and backup drive. I'll be backing up the SSDs, the, so the operating system and the games and whatnot will be backed up to this array, as well as this will be redundant in and of itself. Since I'm using a RAID 1 configuration, what that means is these two drives will be mirrored. So if I have my music collection, my movies collection on those, those three terabytes, it'll be mirrored then on the second three terabyte drive, so everything will be backed up. Now, since these are consumer drives and really affordable, in fact, they're on sale right now at Amazon. I'll put a link down in the description if you wanna check out pricing and availability. But since these are affordable consumer-based drives, they're not gonna really be supported at higher level RAID configurations like RAID 5. So if you do wanna use these disks in an array, then they can only be used in RAID 0, which is a performance-based RAID, meaning you'll have six terabytes of storage, but you have no redundancy at all or in a RAID 1, which is the way I want to use them in a mirrored environment. So two very basic RAID situations. So these are going to be in the Ultimate Gaming PC, making sure you don't lose any of your special settings, etc. But the mission critical stuff is going to be on SSDs, which I'm still waiting for actually to arrive. But I'll give you guys more info on those as they arrive. So anyway, guys, that's been a quick little update and a quick look at a cool, affordable three terabyte drive. In fact, two of them that are gonna be in the UGPC. They also work really well in things like NAS setups or external hard drive enclosures, um, anything where you're not gonna be running an OS off of them. If you wanna run an OS off of a drive as well, if you're just not in the world of SSDs yet, then you're gonna to wanna to pick a different product uh, potentially from Western Digital or Seagate or anyone else for that matter um, that has a higher spec and doesn't have that sort of variable operation like these ones do. I mean, you could do it, but I wouldn't recommend it. Gamefly helps to make Unbox Therapy possible. If you haven't checked out the site and tried out the service yet, now is the right time. They've got all kinds of titles to choose from for whichever console you're using, Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, etc. There's a 15-day free trial right now, so there's no excuses. If you guys want to do me a favor and help out the show, head over to Gamefly.com therapy. Not only will you be helping us out, but you'll also be getting free games for 15 days. That sounds like a win-win situation. Anyway, guys, one more time, that's Gamefly.com slash therapy. I'll drop a link down below as well. Thanks, as always, for watching, and I'll catch you guys on the next episode. Later.